Do we really do? You, does anyone have hot takes we need to talk smack about? I don't have a hot take right now. Does anyone like we saw that has hot takes? I know you were on like TikTok and stuff. Oh, what I saw on Facebook today. Oh yeah, yeah. What, what happened? On oh Facebook? my god! So this dude posted the video of his review of the show, and mm-hmm. I didn't listen to all of it because it was just outright disgusting. So to Zero to Hero, I hope all you grid travelers have found the right podcast to listen to. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of Zero to Hero. I'm Billy. And I'm... Ah! I, dropped, I dropped my coffee. I'm Jimmy. Jim, I'm, uh, I'm watching you. you got nothing in your hands. Thanks for destroying their suspension of disbelief. I appreciate it. You son of a bitch. You piece of shit. <laughs> How do you feel? I feel great. Anyways, so Jim, we should get our little kids. We should get, a, we should we, get our little kid squeals out right now because it happened. Okay, move the mic away. Get it out of the way. Yay! It's finally here. It happened. It happened this morning. We've seen it. We all know. Once and always appeared, and it debuted. We're, it was fun. And it, it was, was fun. Okay. Cheesy and fun. Spo- spoiler free review. It was fun. It was super che- uh, super cheesy. It was fun. It was good moments. We, they had really good character moments, and I had a great time. And if you enjoy Power Rangers, you're going to have a good time, yeah, too. If well, you don't, I'm going to spoil everything, okay? Robo Rita needed her. We're going to get the spoilers no, in a minute. Robo Rita needed her gears waxed, okay? Because that was ridiculous. She she needed her cogs turned. Her co- oh, yeah, sure. Her cog dials, right? <laughs> Clean up the cod <laughs> cobwebs. <laughs> Only you uh, think that's funny. I find it hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. Spoiler free review. Go real quick. What's your spoiler? Re- uh, what's your spoiler free review? It's a fun watch. If you, it's it's honestly a good series for new fans, and a really awesome series for older fans that catch the little hints that they spread throughout the series. Yeah. You get old faces and new faces, and uh, it's just pure nostalgia all over thirty years ago. Yeah, that's all yeah. it is. It's all nostalgia, and it's a, it's a fun nostalgia trip. Definitely, I'm not I'm not disappointed in it. I had a yeah. good time, and they play the original. OG Mighty Morphin theme song, and you get goosebumps. Yep. Oh yeah. Yep. And yep. Okay. Spoiler talk. Uh, spoiler talk inbound. So uh, wee, woo, if you if you wee, haven't seen woo, it yet, wee, woo. go watch it. And come back if you want to hear us talk about this movie uh, or two episodes. Movie? Yes, movie. It's a movie. It's. IMDb says it's two episodes, but screw it. It's a movie. It's a movie. It's fifty-five minutes. It's not movie length. Movie length is an hour yeah. and 30. It's 90 minutes. Well, all right. We, we were screwed out of movie time. <laughs> so let's okay. just say we watched this, right? And it completely just, like, basically disproved a lot of our theories that we had just from the trailer. Oh, yeah. Every theory we had is done. Every theory out the window. Like, what you, what you think was going to happen never happened. Nope. Not one bit. Nope. Mm-mm. And uh, I'm okay with that because I'm 100% on board with no, none of our theories actually coming to, coming to fruition. Yeah. That means we didn't see any of this coming at all. None of it. Flashback? Oh nope. Nope. No flashbacks. No time. Well, there was time travel, but there's no, no time travel took place. Yeah, no. It was just a, a um, lapse. How Robo Rita got her body? Oh, my God. Jesus Christ. Oh. I love how they leave you in suspense in the beginning, but then a couple, like about... 20 minutes in, it des- it uh, it describes how she got the robot body. Yep. So, literally, oh, Zed and Scrozzle out the window. There's yep, no gone. connection. There's no connection to uh, Cosmic Fury out the window. None. Um, they used JDF's uh, voice, like, from, uh, mm-hmm. from the early, from when he was on the show as Mighty Morphin Green. 
and they also use uh, they use Trini's voice from back in the yeah. day. Yeah, uh, Kimberly's and, and Jason. Uh, and Kimberly's, and they went to use Jason's. Uh, Jason sounded a little bit weird, but I think yeah. it was Jason's. It was his, but they only used them once. Okay. Yeah, and that was in but the yeah, graveyard. Uh, and that's it, yeah. Yeah. Uh, completely ruined all our theories that I'm 100% on board Oh, with this. I was completely, I was sitting there laying in bed. I was like, well, now I got to process all this new information. <laughs> like I said, at the end of it, I'm like, uh, okay. So, hey, <laughs> though, they do reference JJ again. A few times, A few yeah. times, and it's from Cat. Cat references yep. JJ a lot in there. Which means he's still in school right now. Yep. So that, uh, so, yeah. so that, that does put them in the realm of SPA and SPD being a thing for JJ. Yeah. So, so that, that might be a thing later down later the line. Down the line yes. Might. Who knows? Uh-huh. Um, but because apparently the solar drag is like the definitive end for Tommy. Yes. Like that. Yeah. 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 And in so. the show, Tommy, well, okay. Definitely spoiler right here. Um, they all go to Aquatar. <laughs> all the, all yeah. the Rangers that were shrunken down. Into figures, are all, all good. All so Jason, Kimberly, Tommy, uh, Tommy, uh, Phantom yeah, Ranger, all, man, all the, yeah, all the figures. If Phantom Ranger was in that too, all of a sudden I'm like, I, I had to go back. I'm like, is that the Phantom yeah, me Ranger? too. I had to rewind. I was like, wait, is that the Phantom Ranger? I'm like, okay, and then the Zeo Ranger is still alive. Yeah, I saw that. I was like, Zio. wait, hold on. Why? Tanya is still kicking so, with her yellow powers. Yeah. But you saw that Rocky uh, had a theory that we we always talk about. Where he just mm-hmm. starts shooting first thing. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, like busts it out, just shoots. He just no questions asked, just shoots. Just and no I'm question. like, yeah, that's Rocky. <laughs> like, all right, cool. I'll live. I, I can live with that. Right. Yeah. But uh, so yeah, let's let's begin this. So basically, in the first scene, the first you know fight scene, it opens up in a fight scene. Like Billy's. Oh my goodness! Billy's getting yeah. his ass whooped right now, and um, she's like, "What do you got to say for yourself?" And he's like, "It's morphin' time." Oh, that was and funny. Did yeah. you notice? Did you notice when they morphed without the morph sequence that the you saw the power reach out and cover them of the coin? Yep, that was pretty. cool, That was yeah. pretty cool. How they showed the coin wrapping around them, like the power coming out of the coin, I should say, and wrapping them and enveloping them, enveloping them. Boy, that was the Envelope. word. Me no word. Impossible. That's called the Thorith. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, you see that, and then. Uh, you see the other Rangers kind of like uh, teleport in off an of SOS signal yeah. that Billy sent out, and that you find out he sent out later in the movie. Yeah. So like the yeah the beginning of the movie. So uh, if you want to go timeline, uh, uh, you know we'll get to it. We get to it. Yeah. So then you know they're they're beating up the putties, and can I just say it is refreshing to actually hear the putties, the angry uh, the angry tur- the, yeah <laughs> angry turkeys yeah. yeah. Would they sound like? <laughs> Dude, that was. Good. I love how they reference that too. Like they're like they sound just like angry. Dude, that was done. great. I love to hear that. You know, so they're defending that. Billy basically goes one on one with Rita, uh, which was awesome. Freaking awesome choreographing and wire work, and like mm-hmm. when he gets hit, like he actually gets hit and he's thrown back. Like it doesn't hold back, right? Yep. And Rita goes in for a kill shot, man. Like right away, right like, she's away. done. Yeah, she, right away, she goes like, in for a kill shot. Trini selflessly blocks the kill shot and gets vaporized, basically off the cliff. Yeah, and that's how Trini dies in the show. Oh man, that's a rough way to go. And like, it was a nice, like not really nice enough, but like, there was anything you could do about it. Like, no. Oh uh, yeah. So um, they took care of that really early in the, the movie. And I like the uh, I liked her daughter. Uh, Men. What's her name? Men, but the the do you know the name the girl who played Charlie her? Kirsch? Yeah, yeah, she she nailed angry kid. Oh, big time! She nailed it. She, oh my goodness! She nailed uh, oppressed anger later on, like yeah. how it like it'll transition. It'll say like one year later, and mm-hmm. it's still her, and she's still holding a, a grudge against Billy. Oh, yeah. Oh, God, oh. that was so brutal. Oh, oh. No. and she laid into him, and, like, you're like, ooh, ow, I'm not even that guy that hurt me. Yeah, like, I was like, damn. Yeah. Ah. And, like, you find out Zach used to, uh, was a congressman? Yeah, Zach was in the poli- into politics and stuff, yeah. Mm-hmm. And then Billy owns his own company called Cranston Technologies. Which ha- uh, houses the command center yep. underneath it all. Yep, which is on Earth. 
Yeah. On Earth. Yep. On yep. Earth. He's not from Aquatar. <laughs> Yep, he came. He uh, he came back from Aquatar for a while uh, to work on stuff on Earth. Uh-huh. Uh, apparently, his girlfriend on Aquatar misses him though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my God. So, I do like so silly. I do like how men like when she's lashing out at Billy. Um, how she's like, you know, if it wasn't for you, none of this would ever happen. And you're like, oh snap! What did Billy do? Like, and then mm-hmm. later, like a couple minutes down the road, it shows what Billy did to cause all the, this whole Man. once and always. Yeah. Dude, like I get Billy, like what he's trying to do, he's trying to bring back Zordon. Yeah. Oh, and another theory disproved. That wasn't the sit. That wasn't the power tube from when Andrews cracked it or cut it. Oh, it looks really similar, similar though. Like it's the same. Oh man. Andrews <laughs> had so mad. nothing to do with it. Nope. Nothing. No, they did have it in space yellow, right? Yes. Yeah. On the, in the truck. Yeah. Yep. Um, so, uh, Anderson didn't have anything to do with it at all whatsoever, and so uh, it was Rita. Rita came back and yeah. broke the tube. Yeah, he uh, because her energy was dispersed. Yeah, along with, and they called it the Z wave in canon. Yeah, they said the Z wave dispersed the evil, but not did, did not get rid of it. Okay, so my theory is correct. You cannot destroy evil. There you go. And then like how mm-hmm. she like Billy doesn't explain it. Robo Rita explains how she came back in the flashback of that scene. Oh. And she takes over Alpha 8. Yep. Alpha 8. Wait, yeah, Alpha 8. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, Alpha, Alpha 8, 8 yeah. takes over his body, then becomes like a robotized, robo, uh, robotized version of Rita. Oh, that was such... I, you know, my jaw jo- dropped. Oh, yeah. I was like, what? Yeah, what? <laughs> I was like, I was, I was like, more dude. shocked because I was like, wait, Billy's like powering up this, uh, this technology to find Zordon because there's remnants of Zordon apparently out there, but instead of collecting the good of the universe it it funneled in rita well rita funneled herself yeah, she funneled into herself it. into this power tube breaks yeah. the power tube in that slash takes over uh alpha eight and then and that's how the movie starts that's how it starts like, and, yeah like she goes to attack, attack billy he runs out uh and the beachfront scene yeah uh is right there near Kranz's yep. technology that fight scene in the oh. beginning is Right after the scene where she takes over Alpha 8. I think it's called like a loopback device. Loop back? I don't know, something like that. Uh, I, maybe uh, the, something something later in the movie explains what happens in the beginning of the movie yeah. kind of thing. But they did it really well, but you weren't confused when you jumped into the movie. Right. No, yeah, you weren't yeah. confused at all. So, so some movies do that where it's really confusing. The first like 10 minutes of the movie is like, super confusing, but mm-hmm. they explains it later. Like, oh, okay, cool. I can go back and like, that makes sense. And now you're like, oh, hey, cool. Yeah. So... Ah, oh, but yeah, so that that happens. Trini dies. Jason, Tommy, and uh, so Rita escapes, runs off for a little bit, comes back a year later, and uh, you, then they start hunting rangers. Yeah, you find out that she's been uh, doing uh, like evil work within that year time span because yeah. Charlie uh, on yeah man is like, have we made any progress against Robo Rita and her forces? And they couldn't find her. They couldn't find her. Yeah, because yeah, because she was in the, the. She said she was going to the uh, dark the dark dimension, yeah. dimension to plan, yeah. which then turns out that she goes back to Pandora's or Pandora's palace. Yep, yeah, her her old her stomping ground, stomp which means it still exists. The the machine part didn't tear it down. Yeah, but yeah, so oh. that happens, and then there's like this one year later, and they're going to the memorial of Trini at the the graveyard, and. And that's where Rita attacks on that. You don't see it because it's just Zack and men, but you can hear the morphing call uh, of the other Rangers, and that's when you hear, like, JDF or Tommy. You hear Tommy, Kimberly, uh, Billy, and uh, Jason. Jason. You hear them, and they, they run, and that's when, basically, they get captured. Uh, Tommy, Jason, and Kimberly get captured in that fight scene uh, with from uh, Robo Snizzard. Which he he bites them with the snake hand, which paralyzes them, and then he sends out robotic snakes, and it wraps them up. Yeah. So and it, and it shrinks them down. And it shrinks and, yeah. them down. It uh, uh, siphons their Toyifies power. Them. Yeah, yeah. And then the the, the machine she's making, Robo Rita made, is a time machine. Yes. And they need uh, they need a lot of power to uh, to use that time machine. Yeah. And so yeah. Um, and apparently the uh, the the Robo Minotaur can uh, can track rangers. Yeah, he was able to track rangers when they morphed. So if they were yeah. if they fought 
without powers, they cannot be tracked. Yeah. It was very interesting, and how it just oh, yeah. how it like breaks it down. Yeah, like they 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 start jumping around in different places, and like the Minotaur is following them in different places. Yeah. Oh man, that was crazy! And and then they they they, they go on full uh, Bendor's protocol. Yes, <laughs> Rocky comes in happy. <laughs> it's like, I just warmed up my noodles. <laughs> okay, I'll give him that. Rocky had a couple really good one liners in there, and they're like really funny, like. Wow, come on, guys. I just warmed up my noodles. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. But, yeah. But a cat comes back, and she, t- she talks about JJ, uh, how he's uh, he's in school right now. She wants to, you know, like, oh, hey, he's in school right now, but I need to get back before. Wait, this is serious. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. So the question I have is that when you see the, the, the rangers that are shrunken down, you see some Lost Galaxy ones. The only they thing, the only thing I could think of is that when they activated the Bandora, um, Bandora protocol, that they went from Mirnoi and back. They came to Earth. Yeah, that's the only thing. I think isn't of. yeah the? I would assume they have a fast travel point at this point now, yeah. like a way to teleport between the two places. Because the last time we saw them leaving Mirnoi, it was on the uh, the 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 galaxy glider. Yeah, well, the galaxy. Yeah. Well, also Billy developed that technology for Adam and Aisha. Yeah, so they, teleport across. So, like, they can teleport in from the yeah. end of the galaxy, but they had to so, be in the galaxy. What doesn't say that Billy could have created something for this power team of yeah. Lost Galaxy? Also, did you see... Okay, uh, yeah, also, you know, Bulk had to come back to Earth at some point. Yeah. And did you see the Bulk and Skull sign for the sandwiches? Dude, I really thought they were going to be in it. <laughs> I know, I was like, dang it. <laughs> dang it. You get, you get about four seconds of the, the Bulk and Skull theme song, and then you get yep. a, you see somebody get thrown through it. <laughs> I'm like, dang, dang it. it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well. Uh, it was still fun. It was a I don't fun. Care. It was fun. Fun. Um, a lot of little, like, a lot of little things, man. And so you, you see uh, men comes, uh, so they, they're starting to go and disperse, like, putties and stuff. But men is, like, trying, uh, they find out, or she finds out that uh, the juice bar is being attacked. Yes. And so she goes and takes the morpher because, you know, she wants to be a ranger, but for revenge. Yeah, and and the morphing grid doesn't want that. Consents it. Yeah, morphing. The morphing is not okay with that. Uh, and so like she goes and like she she's uh, helping people out. And she's, like she's getting people out of the juice bar, and then she's like, "I'm gonna take on these putties." And she tries to morph, and it's like, "Nope." Oh yeah, you know? how those putties were just looking around. <laughs> it's looking like uh, all confused. Like what? 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 But yeah, huh? she she handles her own on herself for a good minute, but then she gets overtaken by the putties, and then that's yeah. kind of when. Uh, Zach, Rocky, Rocky and, and Zach, uh, Zach show, which I am so happy Zach became like a father figure. Yeah. Oh, I. Oh my. I was goodness. trying to figure out who was gonna adopt men because it was a single parent. Yeah. And okay. It's so like it, it shows uh, the mailbox. Men Taylor. Yeah. Or uh, uh, Kawaii's and Quan, Taylor's. Quan, Quan, uh, Taylor Quan and Taylor on the mailbox. So you're like, oh. So he adopted I her. I was like, yeah, okay. Zach adopted her. Oh, hot damn. And uh, dude, that was like, I- I'm telling you, that was like the sweetest moment, yeah. the whole thing. Uh, well, there's a couple other really sweet moments. But that was one of the moments you're like, oh, man. And then Zach has all the father- fatherly advice. Oh, yeah. Like, oh, all of it. The whole, whole thing. Like, okay, so uh, like men attacks Billy, like verbally attacks Billy, yep. right? And so, uh, and then they're going off to do their thing and whatnot. And Zach takes her to the side and is like, hey, Vengeance is not being a ranger. It's not. Yeah. He has no, like that whole one on one in the in the uh, command center. Oh, that was good. Oh man, that was that was great. Where they just he he told her like vengeance ain't gonna solve anything. Nope. It's not gonna help you. Not at all. We, we started this as teenagers, but we if we would use vengeance, it would have never given us anything. Never. But yeah, uh, it was that, a, that was good. So many touching things in there. Oh man, so many good moments. You're just like, yeah. And then we find out Cat can. Cat uh, is a a licensed <laughs> a licensed uh, oh excavator uh, crane operator. Crane oper- yeah. <laughs> operator. Yeah. Like what? <laughs> I like that. I like that plan though. Like where they're they're basically, um, they basically lured in Minotaur and Snizzard by morphing, and then they yeah. trap them with the, that industrial magnet and, on the. And they don't kill them. It doesn't kill them. Because you don't, you're not gonna kill anyone. Like that's the thing. You're not supposed to kill anyone. And uh, but men, like men's, like I'm gonna go. I'm gonna take these people on. And like, oh, that was so brutal, man. Like seeing men try, 
and it's still not working because she's still like full of vengeance. Oh yeah, when she tried to morph again to destroy him right there on the magnet. Then Rubber Rita shows up and is like, "Oh, well, we're gonna take yeah. care of this right and here now." The, and I'm like, oh. "What was the fighting stance men used?" Uh, mantis. Prey mantis. What her mom used. Mm-hmm. Ah, oh, this is such. Yeah, it's good moments. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, just good moments. It was really good man. moments in this thing. Like, and I loved it. And then they, they go to space to take care of the, the t- uh, temporal portal. Oh, how do they get there, though? Undetected. Oh, yeah, they use that those invisibility uh, cloaks. Yeah, yep. That are temporary, and so they show <laughs> Like, Alpha's trying to walk around them. And like, oh, yeah, them. yeah. Alpha's like, sorry, <laughs> I got heavy feet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alpha's adorable. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, oh. Uh, they had that going on, uh, so that's how Billy, uh, Billy, Rocky, Zach, and Cat uh, K- show up there. So they're, they're in disguise, so they can't be tracked over there. And Ming gets captured by Roborita, and so uh-huh. yep. Roborita shows back up on the moon with, with Min and uh, Snizzard and Minotaur. Yes. Robot, Snizzard, Robot, Minotaur. And, uh, oh, dude, like that close battle like scene right there oh man like, like how they close were close quarters battle yeah. scene was fantastic right oh man okay so like normally okay normal fight scenes of power just are like the open field fight scenes right this was and close this quarters. this was closed it was dark there wasn't a whole lot of cuts that we normally would see in power Rangers. there wasn't a whole lot of cuts it was really well done it was I well done it. i like the fighting the choreography and then uh uh, Billy stabs Robo Rita. Oh my god! Like he's like while well, she's distracted because she made Snizzer grow on the moon. Yeah, and he was like, "What?" Yeah, because she was like, "Oh, she's distracted." And you see his trident, his power lance go through her, and you're like, "Get the whoa!" B- <laughs> <laughs> well, before that, before that, we we see Robo Rita try to do a kill, try to get on Billy. Oh yes, and Trini g- jumps in the way for Maybe it. Men, uh, yeah, men so, jumps in the way for yeah, it. Men jumps in the way like her mom did. And then that's yeah. when the morphing grid realized that she's changed her perspective and would selflessly give up herself. So then the morpher men had hidden away in her jacket started glowing. And then men saw all the memories of uh, Trini. The time. Yeah. The, the Trini, the fights, the loving memories that she had with the Power Rangers and what it meant to be. And then her AKA a clip show, clip show <laughs> through an eye because it wasn't a scene like a full scene. It was you're watching yeah. this through her eye, and then she wakes up basically. She's like whoop, and then she's like, oh, this is it. And then they they look. I'm getting goosebumps. They're like you. Uh, what does Zach say? Zach's like you want to say it. <laughs> <laughs> that was. And then great. she like steps up and she's like, it's morphing time. <laughs> and I like the well the morphing sequence. Uh, was just literally what it was back in '93. Yeah, updated. Up, it was just uh, updated. You know, 4K. Yeah, updated. And 4K up. Uh, they, they didn't go all the way like they did for Adam yeah. and uh, always uh, an Operation Overdrive. Yeah. Dang. But <laughs> it was simple to the point. It was literally what it was back in the '93 uh, to '96. Yep. So I liked it. Uh, it was fun. Like, you know, they, they had that really weird logo there for half a second, so it wasn't really, yeah. weird, like, that bad. Yeah. Uh, they got the, a nice war sequence going. Uh, the fight scene, <laughs> just, though, we do get to see their power weapons. Yep. And Rocky uses his power weapon to, like, just stab the Minotaur. Oh, I mean, just downright thrusting, like, midair while he's on the ground, yeah. just stabs Minotaur. With the power sword. And, like, that's never happened it before, never, ever. You never see that. And then, Man, I got a big old smaller face just then, talking uh, about this. The most so useless fun. power weapon was the power bow because she couldn't shoot it in there. <laughs> she couldn't shoot it. Yeah, it was so close quarters. You couldn't really shoot it. Uh, but, uh, yeah, then Billy stabs. Uh, then she, uh, Rita throws Snizzard out, uh, makes him grow big. They start calling the Zords up, and then Billy stabs oh, the uh my God. Robo Rita. And uh, how they updated the Zords when they came out. Oh, that was nice, Yeah. yeah. What aren't aren't the new Zords based off the Zap Megas? Yes. Well, yeah, and you could tell that they were yeah. they were toys too when they were, ass- um, they yeah. were being summoned. But yeah. I mean, just seeing the T Rex come out of the volcano and Alpha was like, mm. "Let's warm up the volcano." <laughs> that was that was pretty fun. Like, let's warm up the volcano. And I'm like, okay, Billy, Billy, and Men 
Like, basically jump in. Jump into the Megazord. Jump in the Megazord. And it's like, Billy's like, just follow my lead. And they got the power crystals. They got this back, yeah. They got the power mm. crystals to yeah. move the Zord. That was, that was, and like, they, to be fair, so the cockpit looks like office chairs strapped to yes, the floor. Yes, yeah, basically. Uh, but, <laughs> you know what? I'll give, like, that's what the original one was, was a little square desk with office chairs strapped to the yeah. floor. It was all, it was fun. <laughs> that's what it was. Yeah. And it was so silly and great. And I like the fact that, you know, Billy, like, Billy controlled, uh, was command of the Megazord. And uh, Rocky was, you know, on the back corner, like he was in Zeo. Yep. And uh, I, it, it was it was a cool sequence, and uh, Zach destroys Roborita. Oh, power blaster too! This is mm-hmm. for Trini. Pew, and then blows her up, but she gets and stuck they, because men use the power daggers to stick her to the wall or the. the oh, that was cool! Yeah, that was super cool! Yeah, and then, and then they, uh, they 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 destroyed Snizzard, and then they all the Rangers are going to Aquatar. Yes, at the very end, yeah. So if, if if we're taking if we're taking continuity from like, the comics, then Phantom Ranger is a morphing master, or a very like, he's a really old morphing master. So, right. yeah, uh, this would be cool. I- I'm here for it. I'm 100 percent on board with this. And uh, I was listening to another podcast. They had a, an excerpt from uh, C C two E two, and it was Adam. Yeah. And Adam's like, if this gets a lot of traction on Netflix, then Netflix is possibly gonna. Is you know saying, hey, we might do a sequel to Once and Always. I'm okay with and that. I, I want them to do more stuff because I I want to get these uh, I want to get these like these actors more work. Oh, dude! I, they, I they want to keep working on it. I'm okay. I gotta with see it. men. I gotta see dude, her. Be awesome. Her character. Development. What did they do? Uh, so there's a comic coming out on the sixth called uh, Ranger Academy, where it's gonna be young Rangers. Yep. In SPA or SPD. What if what if they do that with men, make her like something with that, like a trainer or something um, like that with that? I mean, I don't. Kind of cool. I wouldn't know that realm. I don't read the comics, but I've given you every comic. <laughs> okay. You need to learn to read, not just to watch. <laughs> but yeah, so um, the movie was so much fun, and, and then like they had that little that nice little bit that end, and like oh man, you know, like he's like, do they? Ernie choose for it? Did uh, what? Uh, Zach was like, do they have Ernie's still recipe for his shakes? Yeah, and uh, such a weird shake and then recipes. they start basically going on a memory lane trip with uh, men, telling everything about Trini to her. Yeah, that was a sweet moment because I, I, I'm pretty sure they never really yeah. talked about it. They probably it. never talked. And then how they were describing the monsters and stuff. Like, she's <laughs> like, wait, there was a stoplight on the back of a monster? No, it was a turtle. No, it was a turtle. It was a turtle. <laughs> <laughs> that was and I like how Billy plugs, like, other locations at the very end, too, like uh, Miranoi and, and Aquatar yeah. and stuff like And I was like. He's going to make some rounds. He's going to make like some gonna rounds because go. now he's got places to travel to. Yeah, and it, he, he missed her traveling, so that means he's been traveling around there for a yeah, bit too. So this is going to be very so. interesting because they left it on a cliffhanger, basically, like something could Ooh. come out of this. Yeah, yeah. If, if this is where it stops, I'm okay with it stopping here. But if it continues on, they have a lot of room to they go. They got a lot of room to work off of with uh, what they they. And I'm, they I'm, I'm cool with it. Now, okay, our our fun review is over with. Do we have any? Do does anyone have hot takes we need to talk smack about? I don't have a hot take right now. Does anyone like we saw that has hot takes? I know you were on like TikTok and stuff. Oh, what I saw on Facebook today? Oh, yeah, yeah. What what happened on Facebook? Oh, my God. So this dude posted the video of his review of the show. And Mm -hmm. I didn't listen to all of it because it was just outright disgusting. Uh, Basically, it was like. Zach didn't become the leader. It was a bait and switch. Like you really thought Zach was going to be the leader, but then Billy pulls it. Pulls it because well, because he's white, and he said. First of all, Zach became a father. Yeah, and <laughs> and he says that Zach didn't get leadership because in real life David is gay and white, and I was like, what does that have to do with anything? What does that? You yeah, know? like. And then what? and then he's then he goes on and he starts saying that Min was a horrible character. She didn't know when to shut what? up, and I was like, are you? Are you kidding me? She had the least amount of lines of the whole show. Oh, my God. Like, she should have got more lines. And then when I cut it, basically cut it off as he was going in on the scene where 
men saves the guy the the one guy's boyfriend. So, oh, that was that was that was that so was So now we're going we got LGBTQ representation kind of in the show where the guy Yeah. Well, two gay guys. Two gay guys. Never had that Never before. Never had that before. And she runs down putties while saving someone. Saving someone's <laughs> life. And then this guy just objectifies to that. Oh, my and so goodness. Some people that's just when I cut it off. And I was know. like, I'm done with this. Like, this guy literally just, you know, he took the movie and he just criticized it with political stuff. Yeah. Uh, I will say most reviews I've seen, uh, some of the reviews I've seen have been, uh, were not great. Like, they're not, like raving reviews like we're giving it because you know they're not Pounders fans right like it's a fun that's movie what, it's a lot of nostalgia that's what I but think you know, this if guy, you like it yeah, go, I think this guy know. was like that he he never watched the original series he just watched yeah. this was like oh this is this is trash that's what the literally the yeah. the, the title of the video was this once and always uh, is trash I was like what well he's trash he's <laughs> trash for throwing but uh, throwing. I will say a lot of reviews I have seen though so far like you know most of them have been positive it was like it's fun it's you know nostalgia it's it's great you know yeah. Go and ex- don't go and expecting you know your theories to be true. Yeah. Just go and have a good time. And I'm like, all right, sounds good to me. <laughs> I'm I'm cool with it. Yeah. Like you're gonna see some like, cool stuff. I'm after like, I get done right. with this recording, I'm gonna go back and rewatch it because they said definitely give it a second watch because you're gonna catch stuff you might have missed the first time because of your excitement. Okay, I, I can see that. Yeah, I'll probably rewatch it myself too. Then yeah, yeah. Because uh, I I I'll probably rewatch it tomorrow because I, I wanna. I want to. I want to sit for the TV or eat a bowl of cereal. Again. Okay, that was fun. <laughs> that was fun. I was like, I'm gonna have a bowl of cereal. I'm gonna sit for the TV and watch yeah. this. Yeah, yeah. It was great. I did. All I right. got. I, I watched it. Got in the car and I was like, let me go do. So- I feel motivated now. So I went and I window ex- shopped and I was like, now nah, I'm sad. <laughs> <laughs> I don't blame you. All right. Well, let's cut this episode short tonight, uh, just because it's. It's it was it's the big excitement stuff. Yeah, that man. was like, literally it's the, done. The, like we got the it. That's, point that's was this. Yeah, we we did it. Yeah, we got it. We finally got it. Like, this is an exciting week. Uh, last episode, of Mandalorian's out too. If you're in the Star Wars and oh, Mandalorian, I gotta watch that tonight uh, as well. It's really fun. Uh, Ted Lasso's out. If you're oh. in the Ted Lasso, we're gonna show just end it too. Yeah. Ted Lasso uh, was pretty uh, fun. I like that one. To, uh, I haven't seen it yet. We're watching it tonight. Oh, um, okay. You'll love it. <laughs> it's funny. Right, good. Uh, and then a bunch of other stuff. Uh, and, uh, yeah, oh, Picard's, I think, just end it, too. Uh, and I know Mark is super into that and uh, whatnot. So, yeah. Well, yeah. Like, go have fun. If you haven't seen it yet, go watch the new movie. All right. If you got to this point and, like, listen to all the spoilers, go watch the damn movie, man. Enjoy it. Yeah. You know, and if- I'm not going to say, if, if you can't afford Netflix, do some piratey things oh, geez, but our 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 pirates life for right. me. <laughs> well if you've stuck with us this long and you've watched it and and like listened all along with us you could definitely continue to follow us on our social media platforms uh twitter instagram facebook uh we are at zeo to hero uh zeo to hero.com is our website or no personal plugs which is going to route you there and we, you can also you can jump on our our new Facebook page uh, called uh, Not Lightning Collection, but. So uh, I redid the website. If you like it, let me know because like I redid the whole thing, and I think it looks snazzy. But if you like it, let me know because I want some feedback for it. All right. Don't be afraid to tell me it sucks. It sucks. I, I just... <laughs> okay. All right. All right, guys. Catch you guys on later, man. next week. Do you want to be a hero, but you're not? Do you want to be a Jiro or a Kojiro, but you can't because you're not Japanese? Have you considered Zio to hero? Remember, heroes come and go. Idiots are for <laughs> Jubilee! Jubilee! Thanks for tuning in to another episode of Zio to Hero. I'm Billy, the host. He's the host with the most. I'm the other host with not the most, Jim. Jim, I need to talk to you in my office. <laughs> you know what? Give me, give me the company card. I'm tearing it up. I'm, I'm done with this nonsense. I, you're the one doing it. No, oh my God. I'm done with this. We're done. We're done. You can't get your many pennies. We have lots of raptor claws <laughs> at the place anymore on the company dime. You got to do it yourself. Okay. All right, let's do it again. I'm going to stick with that one. No. That one's pretty funny. 
Mm-mm. We gotta have it more on on point. <sighs> Come on. <laughs> <laughs> 